Really? This has to be some kind of a joke. And the game just crashed on me. <laughs> Hey y'all, what's up? How's it going? Uh, my name is Jack. So, as you can see on your computer screen today, I'm going to uh, take on a challenge, basically, because I've decided to f finally play 2K20 uh, after uh, I think it's been three years since it's been uh, it's been released. And uh, just a little reminder or to let you guys know uh, where I stand on the games, on the 2K and WWE games. I've played every single 2K game up to 2K19 and when I was done with 19, I realized that 2K22 was about to come out so I didn't play 2K20. Not just because uh, a newer game was coming out but mostly because, uh, well, <laughs> you <laughs> kinda know why. Because the game had basically shit reviews everywhere on every platform you could think of. The bugs were game breaking, it crashed continuously. And as you can see right now, I am. Uh, how do I go back to the screen? I'm basically running the first patch, so not a lot has changed, I guess, technically speaking, but I guess we're gonna find out today. So I wanted to try this game. Uh, and oh, by the way, I have played 2K22. I finished the uh, game. I've finished the showcase and the My Player series, and I've played a fair bit of Universe Mode. So I have um, around 65 to 70 hours of gameplay under my belt of 2K22. So now I am playing this for the first time, and I have no idea what to expect. Uh, basically, I like the main menu. It's a lot different than the other 2K game. Let's get into the nitty gritty of it. So, have a look at the roster here. I mean, the models look really half-assed, to be quite honest. If you look closer, you can see that most of the models are just rehashes of the same character. Like, look at Shawn Michaels. Look at his hair. How do you like it? Flipped or front? And the Undertaker, I think this is his uh, WrestleMania 34, 33 version, I believe. The O2 Undertaker, 91 Undertaker, that's nice. Uh, someone who shall not be mentioned again ever. I'm gonna go with Shawn Michael. And I think we're going to face. Oh, they have EC3 in here. 76? They did my boy dirty. <laughs> 76 is. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's not right. Oh, they have two versions of Kurt Angle. I didn't know that. They have the 01 version and the 06 version. Nice. Let's see. Let's see what this game has to offer. I think the main thing that people didn't like was the reversal limit and some of the uh, button configuration that they changed. It was drastically different compared to 2K19. You have the heartbreak here coming out here on this strange... Uh, stage I don't understand what that's supposed to be is that a microwave uh, he kind of looks like HBK has got a little too much lip gloss on <laughs> I don't know what he was expecting <laughs> to do in this match but okay the man who won the Olympics with the broken freaking neck Kurt Angle Kurt Angle's model looks pretty good a lot better than HBK's honestly but I don't think this game is broken in the entrances. Mostly what I've heard from other people is, is uh, it, it usually crashes on universe mode, especially on PC, if your boy still got it. By the way, this is on hard difficulty because I uh, don't want to be roasted in the comment sections. Kick, kick. Oh, this is a lot slower than 2K22. <laughs> I can tell you that right off the bat. Uh, not. It's not bad that it's slow. I mean, it depends on what kind of gameplay you're into. I think 2K22 does a pretty good ma uh, pretty good job of uh, balancing between uh, simulation and arcade gameplay. Don't know what I was trying to do there. The reversal window is very, very short here. 
I have no idea what the hell I'm doing in here. Okay, reversed it. Reversed it. Okay, good. Take this. Oh, easy, easy there, boy. Easy, easy there. Oh, I like the stage. It's a lot like what the SmackDown and Raw stages are these days. Oh, he's running really slow. <laughs> there you go, Russian leg sweep. Let's go to the top. Oh wait, I don't have a signature. Okay. I'll just make do with this. Body splash. Let's see what we can do here from the corner. From the top. Oh, there you go. The hell is the referee doing, bro? Come on! Can I target the referee? I didn't mean to do that. I didn't do that. That wasn't me. That wasn't me. Okay, that was me. <laughs> that was me, okay. We got a match to finish here, dude. Come on. I'm... We have a 1.5 star match to finish here. Uh, I'm not really liking the uh, pace, the pacing of this match. What the hell was that? Why does Kurt Angle... Why the hell does he have these uh, red streaks going through his body? Like, what the hell is that? What, is that some kind of like... Uh, oh, it's like a payback. It's a payback. I don't like the way you have to perform the finishers because you have to push two buttons simultaneously and sometimes you... Really? This has to be some kind of a joke. And the game just crashed on me. <laughs> I like, I heard it was broken, but I didn't think it was this broken. Uh, I think I'm gonna play with Drew McIntyre. Edge looks like a cardboard cutout. Uh, I don't know why. I'm gonna go with uh, Seth Rollins. Seth freaking Rollins. Which version of Seth is this? I'm not quite sure. Let's try Randy Orton. I'm not looking forward to have a... Okay, so the graphics are the same as 2K19, so you can tell that the stage is gonna be a lot the same. It is, okay. So as I was saying, I didn't... Uh, I don't really want to do an Extreme Rules match or use any weapons because it's not fun. It wasn't that fun in 2K19 and... I can only imagine what it is like in 2K20. I'm, they probably kept a lot of the same mechanics though. Oh, he's the Universal Champion. Back when it was red. I never liked this one. I prefer the blue version. The one they have on SmackDown. So this is the Architect. Seth Rollins, okay. The hell is going on with the lights? Is that supposed to be happening? <laughs> what the hell? Those lights are going off way too fast. Whoever is controlling the lights. Uh, he's probably gonna get a hearing from Vince McMahon or Triple H in the back after this match is over. <laughs> because the lights are... <laughs> these, these are freaking disco lights. Okay, let's go. I think it's a lot better on the arcade mode or the arcade setting. Buckle bomb? That's right, baby. That's right. There you go. I reversed that for sure. Like at this point, I, I, I'm suspicious of the game. If it could shut down on me right after I win a match, but I'm pretty sure it can mess with the reversal system. Okay, let's go. Oh. We're looking at Randy. What are you looking at? You want these boots to your face? Okay, I was joking. Okay, well, he just teleported. I didn't know Randy could do that. Let me down. Let me go, bro. What the hell was that? <laughs> I thought he was gonna go over the ropes and then when I saw the animation I thought he was gonna stay in the ring 
and then he just teleported again. Apparently, in this game, Randy Orton has the ability to teleport whenever he feels like it. Before I... I have a come. Okay, <laughs> you don't do that to his face. Come on. Come on, dude. Okay, now it's charged up, and now I can actually do my comeback. Sling Blade, that's right. Charged Finisher, which one is this? Is it the Pedigree, or is it the Curb Stomp? Oh, it's the Curb Stomp, okay. Let's try pinning him. See what happens. And... Should I play on Legend difficulty? Because I'm not really sure about whatever difficulty this is because this is not hard. I've played 2K19 on hard. In fact, I've played a lot of 2K19 on hard and it wasn't this easy. Feast your eyes at the magnificence of Seth freaking Rollins. That's definitely it. I pressed the button to pin him. He turned him around, I don't know why. Really? He, I mean, he, he he didn't kick out of the first curb stomp, but he kicked out of the second one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna... Okay, he reversed it. I'm gonna do a normal move, and I'm gonna try and pin him to see if he... if I get the pinfall. Looks a lot better. Okay, here we go. One, two... Like I said, this game is internally broken. Randy Orton can kick uh, can kick out of one curb stomp, of the first curb stomp, but he can kick out of the second curb stomp, but then he can't kick out of a Northern Lights suplex. Makes no sense whatsoever. Like, this game should not be this broken. Who the hell playtested this and decided it was okay to re release it to the public? Seriously. I know I'm being too hard on the game, but you guys have to realize even though I didn't get any game-breaking glitches, the game did shut down on me, it did crash, the uh, mechanics don't work, the reversal is messed up, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Yeah, I mean, it just doesn't feel right, especially going from something like 2K19 to 2K20, it, it's, it's bad, and I'm not even comparing this to 2K22, because there is no comparison. That game is leagues better than this, and 2K19 is leagues better than this. Visual concepts really, uh, they made, they took a big dump when they released this game in this condition. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed my agony while I was playing this game. And uh, yeah, my thoughts, I guess you guys already know what my thoughts are. I'm never gonna play this game again, I'm probably gonna uninstall it right away. Uh, it doesn't have much to offer in terms of showcase mode because that's also broken thanks to the gameplay and my player is also very mediocre and uh, it's just not worth it it's not worth putting that much time into something like that so yeah 2k20 was uh, a big stain on the WWE 2k series and now we know why now I know why because I never played this game and I actually just tried it and uh, it's safe to say I'm not gonna play this like ever again, especially now that 2k22 is out So hopefully guys you enjoyed this video leave a like because it helps me out with the YouTube algorithm and Susan really likes it when you like my videos and uh, Yeah, subscribe if you haven't already. I have a few more videos planned, which I will be releasing soon. This has been Jack And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out